Hello everyone and welcome back to Dragon Age Awakening where we last left off we went into the deep uh, underground basement where we found someone called Dryer and she was you know dark spawnified we went to kill her and then this that is mine. Looks fine indeed Anders you want a gold earring you shouldn't have Nathaniel wants to howl bow is this what I think it is yes it is that's the how crest burned into the wood right there. This is my grandfather's bow. Or rather, my grandfather was the last to use it. It was originally made for an ancestor during the exalted marches. Why wasn't it used afterwards? Well, my father hid it away, I guess. I'm surprised he didn't simply have it destroyed. I remember finding it before Father sent me to the Free Marches. A shame for it to sit in storage. Thank you. It's good to have a part of my family's legacy again. Something to be proud of. Heck yeah, do you have it equipped already? Yes, you do. Right, what else did we get? Uh, this is obviously for you as well. Oh, I've always won. Visual keep dungeons. Basement. Who's up here? Nope, nothing. Okay. Then. Down we go. Let's go speak to the men over here. Hello, private. Commander. Any messages for me? Just give me a moment. Nope. Glavenac. I emptied out my stores blasting those dark spawn. Once we're done with cold. the pairs. Oh, it's the you two. have been some of our best customers, and they need us. I miss my shop. This place is so drab. It offends my sensibilities. And trust they preserve me. Hooray! Ah. Warden Commander, I represent Master Wade, the finest and bloody coldest. I can't feel my fingers. <clears throat> finest armorer in Denerum. We met before. <laughs> I thought, well, we thought that you might have need of an armorer. I remember you, the Drake Scale Armor, right? My one glittering moment. <sighs> the highlight of my career. And now I'm stuck at Turnip Keep. Vigil's keep. Vigil. <laughs> Sorry, Warden Commander. You know how he gets. Yeah, I know how you get. You kicked me out. What brings you here? This is a temporary relocation. The Darkspawn are most active around Amaranthine. We thought we could help. And I suppose the money the Crown paid us had nothing to do with it? Shh. <laughs> My men will need armor. Providing arms and armor for common soldiers. Oh, the indignity. If we are going to be so dreadfully plebeian, I don't suppose Amaranthine has any proper medal. Silverite? Viridium? Or are we back to bronze weapons? Stone clubs? Wade has uh, a point. He's happiest and fastest when presented with a challenge. If you come across any deposits Well, I did ore, actually. I came across know. some Viridium. Let me see your ah, shop. Of course. Alright, what have you got in your stocks today? Not that much, but you can have these because I don't use these. <sighs> Storm Chaser, uh, Arcane, Dragon Skin Boots. Ooh, Dragon Skin, that's new! And again, those are heavy armors. And uh, blood right there. Panacea. Little shard. Guardian. Let's relocate his or her thingies. Okay then. I have unlocked the Guardian. You're back. You need anything? I found some Viridium. <laughs> this will help a great deal. Viridium? Armor and weapons could be made with this. Commander, if you like, we could outfit your men. It wouldn't cost you anything, but some soldiers would have to guard the miners. 
You have you all have your guards. My need my men need better gear. So I'm to make armor for all Amaranthine's rabble? Heron, you abuse me so it's unconscionable. Commander's orders. Fine, fine, I'll work. But I want a challenge one day. Something to sink my teeth into. Don't worry, you will. We got we still got a few more ores to find. Right. Um wait, wait a minute. Weren't you over Oh, you're a different person. I was wondering... Commander, so this is human construction, is it? My brother said you'd need a stonemason, but he didn't know the half of it. If someone built this in Orzammar, they'd be flogged. Aye, I'm surprised half the buildings in Ferelden haven't fallen over from a stiff breeze. The Darkspawn did a number on this keep of yours, but I suspect it was crumbling well before they showed up. Your seneschal gave me some fancy decree promising men and monies to fix the vigil, but it's a paltry sum. I suppose it would be sufficient to reconstruct the walls to human standards, but who'd want that? Not me. Um, I might regret this, but what would it take to rebuild it right? I'm not certain of the character of the stone in these parts, but we'd need more men for certain. Proper skilled men, not some starving dusters, right? Which all boils down to coin, really. Um, I can spare 80 sovereigns. This had better be worth it. It will be, Warden. Good luck to anyone who tries to breach these walls. Ha! Surface of dwarves. 80 sovereigns to high men to house out the walls. The cost of doing business. Oh, is that it? Right you are, Warden. We'll get these walls rebuilt for you. Oh! The vigil's been what? sacked and rebuilt dozens will endure, of times. Commander. We'll recover from the attack. Do, 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 do. What else have we got? Samuel! Groundskeeper Samuel! Is that you? Who? Make his breath. If it isn't little Nate. I'd know that face anywhere. Groundskeeper, I am overjoyed that you stayed on. Please, do you know how my brother died? And my sister? I was in the free marches. Your brother died in the war. And Lady Delilah, don't you know? She isn't dead, son. Not that I know of. Last I heard, she married a storekeep in Amaranthine. Don't know which one. Poor girl. Did you hear that? My sister is alive. Sounds good. Wonderful news. Could we ask around the shops next time we're in Amaranthine? Don't see why not. Thank you. I would be interested to know just what happened to her. Oh, so you've got a sister and a brother. Or a brother's dead, but still. A kitten! Kitty! Please don't be possessed by a demon like the last one. Hungry fella. I'm gonna take you with me. Oh, I know who wants this. Where are you? There you are. There you go, Anders. Another cat. Oh, look at the cute little kitty. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Mr. Wiggums. Oh, but I don't know if I should keep him. We got into some dangerous scraps. You can stay at the keep then. I suppose. Well, I'll keep him just for a while, until I find somewhere safer. Is that okay with you, Kitty? <coughs> I'll call you Sir Pounce a lot. You can stay in my pack. Just for a little while, yes? <laughs> yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, <coughs> man, manly time. <coughs> Another armor. I don't think we should, should we get a move on. Eat something pummeled? Just say the word. I'll think about it, Ogren. Right, we've got a wooden crate. Wooden recruitment shield. Right, running around. Go around the building. Evade! Uh, there's everything up here, so let's try one level down. I guess that's all we can do. But I want to talk to everyone first. Before we continue on, eh, women are drawdy when you play with that cat. 
like moths to a flame. Women like it when men show affection for small, fuzzy, defenseless beings like you. Yeah, stupid mage. Every time I pull something out of my robes, the <laughs> women just flee. <laughs> That's the wrong kind of small furry thing, uh, Ogren. Wrong kind. Uh. You know, I'm actually not the first how to be a Grey Warden. A distant relative, I presume? Following in my grandfather's footsteps, more like. His name was Padrick Howe. He joined the Order before it returned to Ferelden, just after the war. Never contacted his family again. Just vanished. Now that I know about the joining, I think he died. Many good men and women die in the joining. I know that now. Father always said he was a horrible man for abandoning the family to join a pointless cause. I grew up ashamed of my grandfather. But now I see his bravery. That will take some getting used to. Um... The only shame was your father's. My father often forgot that nobility has another meaning. I told you that the bow you gave me was my grandfather's, didn't I? Thank you for that. At any rate, we should probably get back to it. There right are darkspawn to kill, I'll bet. Somewhere. Darkspawn everywhere? We should keep our mind on the task at hand. Should we get a move on? May I be of service? Uh, no. Farewell, Commander. Bye-bye. Argon, do you have anything else to say to me? Need something pummeled? Need something pummeled? No. Nope. Just say the word. Okay, then. You, uh, you, you. Yes. And then we just leave the keep. Unless some of the missions have gone forward a bit. No. People talk about me stinking up the joint. What are you on about now? Cat piss. Little kitty there makes me want to vomit. Don't listen to him, Sir Pouncelot. You smell just fine. Wait, Ogren meowed. <laughs> uh, right, um, we're gonna go... Right, where is it we need to go? Quests. You've killed some darkspawn, check back later. Uh, Amaranthine. Uh, Forlorn Cove. So we're going to go sort out this business. Oh, we're being attacked. This is good. Ooh. Uh oh, I know those enemies. Oh look, a pile of filth! Let's go rummage around it. This should be easy enough. Yes, please. I wonder if I can completely evade that. Broken crate. Now nah, I won't evade it, I'll just go and attack it. Come on, I know you want to come get me. On it. Well, you were easy. You have anything for me? No? Well, there's no point fighting you then. Off we go on another adventure. This was a pointless stop. Yes. Continue on as our merry band continue on its way to sort out a ransom that someone has done. Because they're douchebags. We're going to go beat their ass down so then it can be no! Don't do that. Another step and poor Lady Eileen dies. Where's Lord Bensley? The deal was he'd give us the money himself. You won't see a sovereign until I see the girl. Orc, show her.
Hand over the gold. Now. Send the girl first, and then I'll give you the money. Orc, send her over. The money. Now. Oh, um, actually, it seems as though I've lost the money. Uh. Screw you! Defend yourselves, men! Mostly the snake. <laughs> plus two, plus one, plus two. Everyone likes my betrayal against thieves. There's no quarter against ransomers. Head off. Oh, a tough bandit, are you? You weren't that tough. Thank the maker, thank you. Tooth of the Mountain Father. Interesting. No problem. I can handle it. You go on home. Uh, Mike to May Wright. Uh, Nathaniel's learned that his sister is an Amaranthine. Okay, then, I guess the next place we're going to go to is Amaranthine. Let's go. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> the port city of Amaranthine. See so, the backup. City of Amaranthine unlocked. Right, what do we have over here? A crate. This should be easy enough. Discarded journal. An elf who lived in Amaranthine writes about the hardships of daily life and unrelated, unrealized hopes of his people. Sounds familiar. I can't go over there. Homer's toys. Who's Homer? Ah, it's the warden commander. The rumors about you did not overstate it. I have a business proposal. Look for me by the house near the gates. I promise it will be worthwhile. Okay. Hello, villager. I can't believe the city guard isn't doing anything to help us. Bell collar. Oh, it's that's for Anders. Anders, mm. I've got another thing for you. Uh, bell collar. You shouldn't have. It's for it's for Sir Pounce a lot. To chickens, silver chalice. You're quite the dirty little the guards, dwarf, aren't you? They won't let anyone You're into the city, but it's dangerous mage. outside the walls. I do my best. Still, I'm no ale-swilling mountain of Belchie. Winking slack jawed coward like you. <laughs> True, we should form a club. <laughs> hey, Shady Our character. Warden Commander. I knew you'd come. You know an opportunity when it presents itself. You don't no? look. I offer a okay. partnership that would benefit us both. Um, I'll hear what you have to say, but I fail to see how working with you could benefit me. There have been problems with trade. As I'm sure you're aware. However, my associates, through certain channels, are able to bring supplies into Amaranthine. There is some profit in this. And as the ruler of these lands, we believe you are entitled to a cut. Um, nah. You're going to be brought to justice. Bye. You appear to be dead. And I loot your body. As you wish. Ooh. On it. Smuggler's Cove, I can't go in. Oh, 
They used to display the heads of traitors over that gate. I suppose my father is lucky his didn't end up there. That sounds... Um... Why is it giving me the option to look at this tree? Ah, oh, can you smell that? That is the smell of freedom. It comes complete with the smell of dogs and dust. But the freedom is in there too. Um... That's just someone baking a pie. Oh, the fact that there are pies around to smell is a step up for me. I've had a pieless existence, more or less. I escaped from the tower seven times. After the last time, they put me in solitary confinement for a year. That doesn't Eventually, sound fun. I'm sure they would have branded me a Malificar, true or not, and executed me. Was the circle of Magi so bad? The problem is that mages are tolerated, barely. It's like you need permission to be alive. There's nothing a mage can do to prove himself. Everyone needs to be protected from you. The end. There has to be a better way. The Tevinter Imperium has a better way. But we know how that argument flies around here. Ugh. All I want is a pretty girl, a decent meal, and the right to shoot lightning at fools. Sounds reasonable. See? I knew you understood. Never mind me. Now and again I recall that I'm not sitting in a cell and I have to smile. That's all. Hello, people with names. Hey, what are you staring at? Looking to start something? Are you the hunter who found an entrance to the deep roads? Oh, here to investigate the chasm, are you? It's about time. I can't take all the credit for finding the rift, you know. Mika here fell in first. <laughs> you don't seem happy about your find. Would have been more useful to find gold deposits. Oh, will you stop your belly aching? Well, it's quite a ways out of town. We were tracking a buck off in that direction, you see, before this darkspawn mess. We'd been on his tail for about a week at that point. I'd wager he thought it was great fun leading us on a merry chase as he did. And the chasm? Oh, the chasm, yes. Uh, we saw it coming over our rise. It was really something to behold. A huge cleft, as though the maker himself had cracked the earth in two, like... like an egg. I like eggs. <laughs> it looked like someone had tried to build over it, but it must have been abandoned a long time ago. No one in town knew about it. Who tried to build over it? Uh, people, I suppose. Maybe even the Darkspawn. Well, of course, we had to investigate. That was when Mika fell in. A shriek like you wouldn't believe, and he was gone. Earth crumbled, not stable. Right. And as Mika lay there yelling about his knee or his head or what have you, the Darkspawn appeared. Looks like you survived. We got lucky. They seemed occupied, like they had some place really important they had to be. Didn't notice us at all, think the Maker. The Darkspawn was so occupied as to overlook two screaming injured men. Boggles the mind. I marked the chasm on my map so we could avoid it, but sounds like you want to know where it is, so yes, please. here you go. Thank you. So, we're getting anything for our trouble? Sure. Um, here's a sovereign. A whole sovereign. If there's ever a reason to fall into a darkspawn pit, here it is. Make her bless you. You're welcome. Bugs out in the forest are as big as your head. Make a watch over you, as they say. I'm all that's left of my family. Don't my touch wife. me! Don't! Well, I but I want to touch you. I thought the blight the was over. My pardon, sir. I was paid a whole sovereign to give this letter to you. Okay. I told him I did. There are easier ways of getting a message to the Commander of the Grey. Who gave this to you? Some visiting knight didn't catch his face. Full helmet, you know. He said he was... Sir Wolf of Ravain. Wait. Wolf? As in the Dark Wolf? Ah, the Dark Wolf. Nothing but a rumour. Mind you, he was acting suspicious. Do you remember anything else about him? No, sir. Again, my pardon. No problem. It's the constable's orders. That you were handed a note that indicates the Dark Wolf will meet you by the fountain. Can I read this note, or...? There's no place for you in the city. Well, they don't look infected. And he I has hate children. waiting, look, knowing what let some Those smugglers are bastards for taking advantage of the chaos. Ooh. Hello. Oh, excuse me, but I need to search your packs for smuggled goods. 
I'm the warden commanders of Vigil's Keep. But I have to. Constable's orders. We've been having trouble with smugglers and... What are you doing, man? Are you accusing the commander of the Grey of smuggling? But I... I... You said everyone... You are dismissed. Ugh. Rookie. I apologize. Smugglers and thieves have all but taken over the city. I've killed, um, glad to see you're taking precautions. Yes, Warden Commander. The smugglers have a scrambling, to be honest. We could certainly use your help in this. Come speak to me later if you're interested. I am. And you can go bugger off. You have the same name as my brother. And you look exactly like him too, which is ah, creepy as well. Warden Commander. I take it oh, he you decided he doesn't. to help he us. Looks, he looks like him when he was younger. Um, what exactly is happening here? With trade slowed to a crawl, smugglers have moved in, selling stolen goods at exorbitant prices. If we could shut down their operation and seize their supplies, we could distribute it to the needy. How do I find the smugglers? There is a smuggler doing business in the market. He probably knows where the hideout is. We haven't been able to get anything from him, but maybe you can. Sure. Uh, but I would like to go up here first. Stairs to the battlements. If anyone can get rid of the smugglers, it's the Grey Warden. Yep, we are good. As you wish. Why didn't you let me click you? If anyone can get rid of the smugglers, it's the Grey Warden. Yeah, I, I said that. You already said that. Wait, what? No, go back. I want to go from the front. Yep, that's mine. As you wish. All right. You're going beyond the call of duty, Warden Commander. Yeah, I know. You're going beyond the call of duty, Warden Commander. Yeah, I know. Why don't the guards do Why anything the dark about these going away? I hear it's a plot started by the Grey Wardens to get tough. Right. Um, we're going to end here for today. Uh, hopefully you guys have enjoyed it so far. In the next episode, we're going to be looking around the city of Amaranthine, helping everyone with their problems, because that's what we do.